Okay, Virgos. This is your reader for the full moon and Taurus read. Okay, we're going to see what's going on for this full moon for you. Gods and goddesses, Virgos, which is health and gain this day. Okay, so you might be gaining health or something that day. Mental activity, like I said, mental health, mental clarity about something. That'll be coming in fast on that day. Okay, let's go. Let's keep this going. Like you're going to have control of your mental stability, mental activity. After, yeah, somebody try to come in and emotionally, uh, they backstab you. Death. They try to put you to an end or your mental activity. You're trying to have control over your mind. That's what I'm getting. They try to put you to an end by having control over your mind. <laughs> so basically like some mind control. Yeah. Yeah. Mind control. This could be in the karmic duo. So what I'm getting like, basically try to make you feel like, have your mental activity like, they did this to you like three times. Like ghosted you, came back, ghosted you, came back, kept back out of you. This could have been up to ten times. I see like a lot of swords out here. This could have been an air sign that did this to you. Also, yeah, we got the knight of wands. They'll come in swiftly, then backstab you. Then all of a sudden they start playing these emotional games. They say they don't want to be with you, they want to end shit, you know. And then this, they could have kept doing this. This is a karmic relationship. Okay. They was putting you in a lot of third parties. They could have put you in a lot of third parties. But you're going to be good. Independent wealth. Okay. After you stand your ground. Or you have to stand your ground. Queen of Pentacles. There we go. Accumulation. You probably got insight on this. Okay. Yeah. They're trying to make you insecure. By doing this. Yeah. This is what this was all about. Give me something on this. Give me something for mental activity. So they kept. They, they they kept coming in, coming out. This is what I'm getting. Mental activity. And then you got endings, defeat. It's in and out, in and out, in and out. And then they tell you, this is ended. And they act like it's ended for good. But then they turn around and come back and put you in a lot of pain. This caused you a lot of pain. This was a karmic relationship. Or they had karmic other feminines that they was in collaboration with doing this to you. They could have had like 10 different affairs. Or three really, really hurt you. Like, I feel as though it was, like, probably a lot of options they kept backstabbing you with. But three of these people that they had affairs with really hurt you. It could have been family. That's what I'm getting. Like, it really hurt you. And you really tried to hold on to this. Like, mm. Ciao. So, that's what I'm getting. Betrayal. Let's go. Give me something for mental activity. So they basically was trying to drive you crazy. <laughs> Romantic love affair, love on the brain. Let me straighten this up. Yeah, this is crazy. A bunch of clout hungry females. They kept fulfilling fantasies. Uh, like with your family members and fake friends. and Yeah, they was putting you in competition with your friends and shit like that. Keeping you a secret. Saying they wasn't fucking with you no more. But these, I was about to say hoes, but they know better. They knew better, like, yeah. So, ooh, wow. You probably started investigating this. Yeah. And every time you try to start a new beginning, like, they'll use sex to gain entry back into your life, and then they'll leave again. Like, this is some, ooh, I'm just still in this energy. That's bad. You know, I mean, you don't play with people like this. They reject you all the time. Yeah, then when the situation gets explosive, then they then they jet out, like, and then come back. Excuse me for one second. I'm straightening out these cards, Virgo. Guys and goddesses, this is for both of y'all. And you know who I'm talking about. <laughs> this could have been an air sign. This could have been a Scorpio. Um, this could have been a Capricorn. Yeah. Or oh, these Scorpio and this Capricorn was working together to destroy you. This could have been two men that was working together 
to basically uh, have you emotionally drained and uh, play games with you, kept coming in playing games with you. It could have been two people. I seen boss daddy that you thought was boss daddy. Yeah. Let's go. Mental activity. Give me some for mental activity. So they was trying to send you crazy. <laughs> it's not funny, but betrayal. I just seen that. Give me some for mental activity. With this Knight of Swords energy. This is the Knight of Swords. Like fast with, come in, get out, get what they want, get out. Yeah, this is that energy right here. Give me money. I just seen that because they're broke ass too. Oh, uh, let's go. Mental activity. Give me some for mental activity. We had a whole bunch of damn groupies. Mistake. Misunderstood. Victim. Lost soul. This is a lost soul. A lost cause. Give me something for um this ten of swords ending defeat depression. I told you. They thought they defeat you with this depression, but I don't think so. They thought they ended you or they wanted to end you. This is a Capricorn and a Scorpio. That was a collaboration doing this and another female. Um, two men and a woman that was doing this. This could have been a family member. Uh, yeah. That was purposely doing this. Only you. Devoted, attached, care. And they come in like they care about you. Saying it's only you. But then they keep coming in and out with this devil energy. And they only come in because you, they want you to give them money. Because they see you as a divine feminine or divine masculine. Uh, pain. Just to cause pain. They was doing this pain shit on purpose. So these are two men collaborating together with a woman. Give me something for three of swords one day. Someday, somewhere, another time. Like I told you, like they'll come in and say, you know what? This is ended. They make up any excuse. Like this is ended. They had a whole bunch of fake friends. Single, lonely, because they want to see you single and lonely. You know, this is crazy. Give me um something for the devil. Recording. Announcement, expression, revealing. Yeah, they, ooh. you could have said this to them, like, I feel like you the devil in my life or some shit like that. Or they probably could have said this to you to destroy you, like, you the devil in my life. I'm going to reveal something about you because you rejected them. And you know they always partying and be out there fake flexing, releasing. They be fake flexing with your money boundaries. They mad about that, that you released them. So it's two, it could be two of your exes. Like a Scorpio and a Capricorn that joined up, teamed up together. Take it as a resonate. A man or a woman, two men, two women. Take it as a resonate. And they say, one day I'm going to keep coming back in, breaking your heart. That's what it is. And that's what the three is for. We're going to just keep doing this, doing this, doing it. We're going to drive her crazy or him crazy. We're going to keep doing this. We're going to sleep with their friends. We're going to sleep with their family. We're going to sleep with any fucking body. Anybody they don't like. That's what I got. Fake friends. Make fake smiles. I'm telling you. Like you had friends that had, that you had memories with. Fake smile and they betrayed you. Like, and then they force you like to give them money. When they come back with these fake smiles. Like you probably giving them money. They spending this with these um family and these friends. And you showing loyalty. And at the same time, you try to every time you try to heal, that's when they do it. One day, I'm gonna come back in because they want you to fall apart, fall to pieces because they bitter and they mad. Damn, that's devilish. If that ain't devilish, tell me I want a second chance. I want a second chance, but they they really playing. Give me something for <laughs> teamwork, <laughs> three of pentacles. Because that's where they want you at, the Three of Pentacles. Realize that your light irritates their demons, your family, your friends, your foes, thief. They come in as a thief in the night, thief of joy, realizations. You probably had an awakening about this. Yeah, understanding that they ain't shit and that you need to heal from them. Yep, that's what it is. Mm-hmm. Destroyed, shattered, broken, fucked up. They want to destroy you. That's what I'm getting, getting played, manipulation, lies, control. I told you they was controlling you. They wanted to control your money. They wanted to control everything. This could be somebody you got a, a divorce for that started going with, playing with you, they ex. Because you was your other ex, because you're unbothered with them, and you abandon them, and you use your intuition. They want you in a girl fight. Probably a girl fighting for them and every fucking thing. 
They was doing it. They this is a teamwork right here, boo boos. Man or woman. They teamed up. Probably your ex husband, your ex wife. They teamed up together with your friends, your family, to go ahead and uh, basically do this to you. Like try to fucking destroy you. They wanted you fucking destroyed because you abandoned them. They had a distance. And they get together. Like, they celebrate together. They cl plan these meetings. They plan these meetings on you to destroy you. Which way they can destroy you. Yeah, dirt digging. Looking for dirt on you, vice versa. And they always dirt digging. Like, trying to plan to get some dirty offer. And then they come in with this dirty offer. They get some uh, dirt on you. They already know it, but they'll come in and get some, like, this could be from your past, and then they come in with a dirty offer. Like, this is crazy. Dirty. These bitches could have bad habits. They be at their breaking point for you, and they come in with a fake-ass apology. Yeah, send not illusions. Yeah, they be doing this at a distance, having this meeting. What the fuck I just picked up? Or you might find out about this, that you have an ex that you could have got a divorce from, and your ex-boyfriend, your ex-girlfriend, your ex-wife, whatever, they teamed up with a family member, teamed up with people to come up against you, to keep making dirty offers towards you. Then they come in just to dirt dig on you. Then they leave out. Then they go back to have this meeting. They're a thief of joy. They ain't shit. They, they just, why you healing? You be sitting up there healing, and they keep trying to destroy you. And they expect you to fight for what you love, claiming what you love. They coming in like they really fighting for you. Uh, You'll find this out, Virgo. You about to find this out? Mm, that's dirty. And that's and they try to make you bitter and crazy by sleeping with your family members. They want you to fall apart, fall to pieces. And they'll dirt, the dirty thing is, they'll come and say, it's only you, though. But you'll find out they, you didn't slept, they didn't slept with your family, your friends, people you hated. It's three people in particular. It's an air sign. And a, it could be three motherfuckers. That's what I'm getting out of this. It could be an air sign. It could be a, a Scorpio and a Capricorn. Those are all the three exes in this damn photo. But they be, both, all of them be sleeping with your family. And then when they dirt dead, they come in swift. Like, I got some information on you. Da, 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 da. Like, bitch, you're talking about somebody past. Nobody gives a fuck about it. You get what I'm saying? Virgo, good luck with this, but you about to find this out. Or you found it out from me what was going on. You got clarity on it. Anyway, if you was thinking anything, this is what it is. This is spirit to where you got. You get nothing but the truth and fast me. I love you. You take care. You keep yourself in prayer. You stay grounded. Okay? Love you.